to make your own service connector thing for uh, OBD2 vehicles, you're going to need a few tools. You're going to need some electrical tape, a little piece of metal uh, soldering tool, and a wire cutter stripper thing. And this over here is the two pin connector from a, I think I pulled this from a Honda S2000 or it might have been a EG Civic. I uh, honestly I forget, but any Honda or any Honda or Acura should have a thing, something like this underneath the driver's seat because as you can see it's just a seatbelt clip when you buckle up in your instrument cluster it'll say that you're buckled up and that light will go away so that's what this is for you can also probably find something like this a tube and connector on uh, the door panels where the front speakers are you may find a similar um, connector but I'm not 100% sure so what you're going to do is simply chop it anywhere it's fine I'm gonna cut it right about here like so there it is. You can pull this off and keep it. It's up to you, but this is it right here. And now, you're going to strip some of this wiring. I don't know which one it is. Let's just take a guess. There we go. There's one. There's two. And now, all you gotta do is twist these together. And that's it. I'm actually gonna pull just a little bit more off. Just for the sake of doing it. So I have some more space to work with. Okay, so. Exposed wire. Now let's just somehow twist these together. Come on. Oopsies. There we go. There we go. Not the greatest job, but the point is so that they're touching, as you can see. You can take it another step further by uh, using a soldering tool and connecting it all together like that, and then using some electrical tape, or you can just simply put a piece of electrical tape on here right now. It may be a little tricky, but it this does not have to be perfect. Just as long as those two wires are touching, you should be good and there you have it I used too much so I'm just gonna cut it and there that's that's it so I'm going to leave it like this you may use a soldering tool on this part right if I had the tape off you can use a soldering tool on that and melt it all together if you wanted uh, I'm not going to do that I think this is enough uh, some people may disagree they may feel the need to use a soldering tool which is completely fine it's all up to you but I'm gonna leave it like this and uh, that's that's it so this is your service tool that will help you retrieve the code for a check engine light, a ABS light, or a ATTS light on a Honda Prelude. Um, you can use the exact same tool on uh, other Hondas. It's the same thing, but many people use it. And that's it. There you go.